This is the WWE superstar Alberto Del Rio, but of course you already know that. Keep watching The Roman Show. Rodolfo Roman with the World Heavyweight Champion of the World Wrestling Entertainment, Alberto Del Rio. I had to say that, Alberto. Well, but you gotta do it like Ricardo used to do it. You need to roll your R's, Alberto Del Rio. <laughs> Alberto, we're here at the World Series of Fighting. You are no stranger to mixed martial arts as you yourself fought Krokov. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, this uh, this was part of my world eight, nine years ago. I was fighting in Japan, Korea, Mexico, Brazil. And that's the reason I'm here, because I love this. I love, I, I, I love and admire all the things these guys are doing right now. These guys are fantastic. They put in a great show tonight for everybody here. Going back to MMA, how, what's some of the stuff that you learned from MMA did you bring to, uh, to pro wrestling? Well, uh, Jiu-Jitsu. Uh, I was part of uh, Marco Hu's team when I was training with him in Brazil. And I have, I have learned a lot of things from him, especially my finisher, the cross and breaker. That's an armor, an MMA armor. And uh, I always try to use all the other things that I learned with Marco Huas or whoever I was training when I was fighting into the the, the, the WWE world. Do you see more wrestlers bringing that in? Because Undertaker credits himself for bringing in the MMA, but you got CM Punk who comes in with, oh, yeah. with the jiu-jitsu jackets and everything. Well, as we know, a lot of the MMA fighters are fans of WWE, like, like we are fans of MMA. Now we're here because they invited us, and uh, this is a great show, it's a great event, we have great fighters. Uh, one of my friends, Miguel Torres, is in the, is in the octagon right now, and I'm sure, I'm sure he's going to put a great fight tonight. Uh, like I said, I'm a big fan of MMA, and that's the reason I'm here. After the E, do you think you could get step inside a cage one day? Uh, not anymore, that's part of my past. I had a lot of fun when I was doing it, I was making a lot of money. But uh, luckily for me, WWE treats me so well that I don't need to step in the octagon or in the ring for MMA again. One question, John Cena, the return, Hell in a Cell. You put your title on the line tomorrow at the American Airlines Arena here in Miami. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Tell me about it, John Cena's coming back, but he looks stronger from those promos that we've seen. Yeah, but you know, uh, I'm gonna kick his ass. This is my hometown, this is where I live. All these guys are my neighbors, my friends. They're gonna be there supporting me. All that big Latin community is gonna be there at the AA Arena supporting Alberto El Rio, not John Cena. And uh, that's gonna give me the strength to get the victory. So at the end, the winner will be Alberto Del Rio. One last question. WrestleMania. You've been you've been participating in several of WrestleManias, but if there was back in the past or in the future, of course. Who would be a dream match for you that you would always Undertaker, like? baby. Undertaker. That's a, Undertaker is like the godfather of wrestling. And that would be my, my dream match. I don't know if it's going to happen because we know we only have like one or two years more to enjoy Undertaker with us. So hopefully if it's going to be next year or the following one. But if it happens, great. If it never happens... Uh, that's fine because uh, because I admire him no matter what. Alberto, I want to leave you alone. I, want, I know you want to enjoy El Miguel Torres fighting right you, now. Thank, thank you so thank very you. much and good luck tomorrow against John Cena. Thank you. Thank you.